So we've exposed his chin and we're doing a chin augmentation. I've done the marking for the osteotomy and also we've done the planning for the distance from the apex of the teeth and the mental nerve. So here we have less height of the bone, but still we're going to do both vertical and horizontal augmentation. just on the astronomy. Chin augmentation done. Permanent predictable safe type with bony osteotomy. I'm going to show you with the scale here about the vertical improvement or increase in height. Translates to 5 millimeters. I'm going to double check this way. So that's the gap that we have in this place which relates to the vertical augmentation and you can see it's 5 mm. Now let's move to the horizontal part. Uh, this is a male genioplasty. So the patient desired a much stronger, broader chin. I'm coming to that part in a while. I'll show you this part first. So that translates to 10. 10 and 5. And you see I've done some sculpting, contouring here. This is the broad part of the chin that's now visible. And that's more than two and a half centimeters. So it's got a much, much more broader chin. And it's got a much projected chin. And the lower third of the face is being made more proportional as well.